There's one thing about the documentary I find absolutely unbelievable. Which is? There's a lot of things probably, but go ahead. No, no. There's one specific thing okay. that I do not believe. Food poisoning? I do not believe. It's not about food poisoning. I don't believe that five guys can be in a room at two in the morning and only one of them orders pizza and nobody else has a bite of the pizza. Mm. Crazy. Just heard an excerpt from the director about this. He was yeah. on another podcast and he was saying the story is mm -hmm. apparently everybody ordered dinner without Michael Jordan earlier. Right. And so like they didn't wait on him and he got there late or something. They all ate without him. So he was pissed off at everybody. So he's like, fine, let's find food. I got to eat. Pizza is the only thing that's open. They're not in Salt Lake City in downtown. Yeah. For some reason, their hotel's like on the outskirts. That is believable that pizza's the only thing So the pizza open. comes in. Yeah. MJ says, none of you guys are eating this. I'm going to eat on it. And then he spits on the pizza so nobody else can eat it. Sounds like MJ. Doesn't so, no. sound like MJ. So here's the thing. So I believe that he wanted a pizza to himself. Right. I also believe you're a 6'6 athletic machine. You could eat a whole pizza to yourself. I could yeah. eat a whole pizza to myself. Right. It's not that hard. Yeah. I don't believe... That you would order only one pizza. I think if there's five guys, five people or five guys are in a room mm. or however many guys are hanging out, but it seems like there's a yeah. few. You really think five dudes are going to share one pizza? If we order right now, four of us are about to order pizza. We're going to order one single pizza. MJ knew he was eating that pizza by himself. Nobody else ordered pizza. Yeah. I don't buy it. I think that is the only fictitious thing going on here. I don't know what got him sick. I don't know if it was partying, drugs, who the fuck knows. But I do not buy that a pizza was ordered and nobody else was like, yeah, just get two. Why not? This is a life of luxury. This is you just buy I, bottles. You just frivolous. This I is also a, they put a stupid license plate on my Range I'm Rover. I'm a little One skeptical. Pizza. I'm a little skeptical that five dudes come and deliver a pizza and then my personal trainer, who I've been with for over a decade now, says. Hey, man, something about this doesn't seem right. I'm going to be like, yeah, you know what? Let me eat the whole thing before the finals Yo, game five. Can I, can, I, too serious. can I be honest with you? Five dudes delivering the pizza makes the most sense to me, mm -hmm. especially if they're not poisoning it. Think about it. If you were going to poison Michael Jordan, why would more of you go and wave your hand and be like, hey, look who gave you the food mm. poisoning? To me, it's like, oh, shit, we're delivering a pizza to the hotel where the Bulls are staying. Everybody at that pizza store and their friends are going, it might be Michael Jordan. Let's just all go. Right. Maybe it's Sky Piven. Maybe it's Robin. Right. Still cool. Fuck it. Luke Longley. We'll take it. It's going to the hotel where the right, Bulls right. are. It's got to be the Bulls. Yeah. Right. They're all showing up. They're admitting guilt if they all show up. The second there were like five guys came to the hotel, I was like, nope, not food poisoning. No way in fucking hell. It cannot that makes be. Sense. That makes sense. Right? You're admitting it. It's like only a rapper would be so dumb to like say they did the crime. Also, That's what these guys are doing. I need a real doctor, not just an Indian, to verify this. But my understanding is food poisoning takes like 36 hours to really take hold of it's like. I can push back on that from personal experience and Jamil can attest to it. What happened? We both had the same sandwich, but his metabolism is way quicker than mine, I guess. And <laughs> he got sick quicker while we were living together. And he was throwing up in the bathroom. And I was like, you stupid fucking idiot. You can't eat lettuce, you bitch. And then literally two hours later, I was like, huh? huh? <laughs> so after he recovered, <laughs> I'm in the bathroom just shitting and throwing up. And he's just going, you stupid fucking idiot with your slow metabolism. Uh, it's funny. Okay, fair enough. But yeah, I don't know. It's that a little I sketchy, right? But Tim Grover has always thought it was food poisoning. I remember I read his book and he That's said, fair. I think it was food poisoning. Five guys delivered it. I felt weird about it this day. Okay, let me throw something at you. Also, real quick, if yeah. you're Jordan, a guy who believes what he believes and you can't convince him differently, mm -hmm. if he thinks it was food poisoning, nothing will change his mind. That's the story he's going to stick with forever. If so, he thinks it's food poisoning. I think it was food poisoning, but I don't think it was intentional. Okay. <laughs> it, it's late. It's the last place open. I'm pretty sure they just have shit sitting out. It probably went a little bad or whatever the case is. Like, there's uh, just a ch there's a chance. I, I, there's a chance. There's a chance. I've worked in a pizza place. Yeah. I spent my childhood working in a pizza place. Dude, the pizzas would be out for fucking days and we would eat them. Nothing goes bad. Like, the cheese is so processed. Like, everything is so fucking. But what about the meats? Like, you have the pepperonis and all that well, shit sitting out. Pepperonis dried, right? So, it's like, it's already pre-cooked. You can leave pepperoni out for a while. I know. Your, your thing is interesting and. Sometimes coincidences happen, and when they happen to like 
great people were like, uh uh-uh, uh, something's going on here. Right. But like if you and I can get food poisoning, so can Michael Jordan. Yeah. But when it happens to them, they're like, there's an attack. Right? So I think that could be it. Or what I thought was really interesting, did you guys pick up on they left a scene with Jerry Sloan in the press conference where he goes, Was Michael sick? I didn't know he was sick. Yeah. Why leave that in? I'm almost like, I know this is Jordan's people. I think Jordan thinks Jerry Sloan did some shit to him, oh. yo. <laughs> I dead ass think so, man. Oh, I didn't take it that way. I take it as uh, they were just showing his humor. Oh, yeah. so he was being sarcastic. Yeah, it was yeah, like, yeah, yeah. oh, I thought he was, was saying like everybody's story. talking about Jordan being sick. Okay. Yeah. Okay. We're still fucking talking. Okay, I get it. Jordan was, sick. was Jordan sick? I hadn't heard I'm off that. It. I'm off it. Because I, yeah. I first saw it and he had me convincing. I guess I wasn't looking at Sloan through that like, like sarcastic, uh, come- uh, like yeah. a coach lens. You know, you see a lot the of the other game. He was like, Oh, this was the actual final. Yeah, score? yeah, like, yeah, you know, yeah. So. I feel like they. That's fair. I that's feel fair. like maybe Jordan likes Sloan, so he shows him in like, "Hey, look at his light moments." Like he still mm. got a sense. I like, kind of like Popovich being funny in a press conference. Yep. When Jerry Sloan is just kind of like a sense of humor about getting blown out. Like, okay, this is it. Huh? That's this is fair. How much we lost, but if Popovich said that, I'd be like, "Oh, he's being sarcastic." I just didn't. I right. wasn't familiar with Sloan enough. Fair, complete. Or some that just hit me. Black people are sensitive to lactose, but yeah. some people are more like. Once you hit a threshold, then it bothers you. So yeah. say I can have one slice of pizza, but if I have eight slices of pizza, yeah. then I'm shitting for days. Maybe his selfishness is like nobody else is having this pizza but me. Yeah. And because he ate too much pizza, that could have been it. But is he throwing up? You ever thrown up from lactose? I be getting diarrhea I sometimes, but I, I yeah. never diarrhea. throw up. I can't fathom that Michael Jordan is lactose intolerant. I just can't fathom that something that bitch ass would be part of Michael so Jordan. Do you see him? He looks like death. I mean, still Ooh. believes it's a hangover. Michael Jordan. Yeah, it's a fucking hangover. Dude. I've never been hungover, obviously, so I don't know what it looks. I just, the fucking look on his, there's that, I think he like dunks it and then he just kind of like touches his wrist, like just looks mad, exhausted and like yeah. pathetic almost. That's after a point. hangover. That's a hangover? Yeah. I don't know. To me, it looks like dehydration, man. You what know, is a hangover? What is yeah. the definition of but a hangover? But if you have yes. a hangover, you get the IV, which he got before the game, and that's like the hangover cure. Now, that's true. Getting an IV will snap you out of the hangover. Because I think a hangover, all it is, is your body reacting to dehydration. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Right? So then you get those fluids in your body, and you should be fucking good to go. So maybe it is something bigger than the hangover. Or maybe they just exaggerated it. Who fucking knows? I just didn't believe the pizza thing. I don't want to take too much time on that. I just didn't buy the pizza excuse. And he really like stomped his foot about it. You know, like yeah. it was weird. It was like, it was almost like he was on the stand. He was like, I ate the pizza. No one else ate the pizza. Like, what's going on, bro? Like, why are you so and pointed that, about that? To that point, I do think something's fishy about it because yeah. when you try to give too many details, that's usually a sign you're lying. Exactly. It's like with your like, girl. Like, like what'd I'm you do the, last night? I'm the well, only we were one. at Akash's and then right. I texted you about 930. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, <laughs> Get out of here, You have to point out I'm the only one who ate the pizza. Like, everybody's hat for some reason felt the need to point that out. It's like, he's the only person who ate the pizza. It's, that pizza came. Five people showed up. He is up, a like, psychopath enough, though, to be upset at people for ordering without him. And then saying, I'm going to eat this whole pizza myself. There's somebody in this oh, room yeah, who would probably do something like that. <laughs> What's that? <laughs> What's that? What's that? <laughs> <laughs>